Also in that app, we have a hurricane tracker, very important. So if you have family or friends in the storm's path, Brittany Beggs will be along in a moment to explain how you can follow the storm from your phone. Brittany. All right, we're talking about Hurricane Dorian. We told you you can track Dorian inside our apps. I want to talk about the main app, the red app that has the channel three icon. Once you bring it up on the main page, there's going to be a menu tool here. Click on that menu tool that's going to populate search item, a weather item and a radar item. Select the radar item. Once you select that, of course, radar is going to populate. On the right hand bottom, there's going to be a layer tool. Click on that. Different things are going to populate, but what you want to keep an eye on, make sure tropical tracks and tropical weather alerts are both selected. That what that'll do is anytime new advisories and new tracks are released from the National Hurricane Center, those will be updated straight to your phone. So make sure you zoom back out once you go back to radar and you'll be able to see the latest track and where there are watches and warnings. If you didn't follow this, no worries. You can read and listen to this again uh, online at WRCBTV.com. Brittany, more from Brittany a little bit later in the hour and we'll